Here's our campsite from last night. It took me an hour after everybody got in. But the miracle was I got in here when it was still light, which is very unusual for me. Over to you, Adrian. Yeah, he likes to do the special entrances at night, the darkness hiker. But yeah, as you can see, uh, we passed the road crossing that had the M and L, so we kicked two access points in one shot. It's pretty cool. There's my awesome pack. Oh, I love the hyperlight. And this is why we camped. They had these blocks of wood. We messed them up around a fire pit, and it's on the trail. So just after the uh, M and L, westward. Look at that trail. You can uh, stop here, Kyle. What about yesterday? What do you think about the trail? <laughs> it was a tease. What do you mean? One second you're like, oh, this is a great trail. The next is like, oh. oh Trail's supposed to be flat. <laughs> you read about this trail and it's supposed to be flat. And you're like, oh, it's, it's, it's not going to be that hard. And it's not flat at all. And this is your first through hike, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, and how do you feel about that so far? You're almost, you're halfway. I feel good. That's cool. And Thumper, how do you feel about uh, yesterday? Oh uh, yeah, it was very, it, it was constantly changing. It would follow the river, it would be flat. And then you would be up on the ridge lines. For no views. Yeah, and then you'd get to a part that was kind of boggy or even a beaver dam. And you'd have to go down into the, the valley and cross the stream or whatever, even a marsh and come back up. But yeah. uh, the last bit was really great because there was a, uh, it was like you were coming onto an old logging road. So I got to the uh, orange boxes where, where you can resupply, right right in the middle. This is the halfway point. And then after that, you come to a road, the uh, uh, East Steel Bridge. And, and we cross the, the bridge there to have a look to the other side. And so we're not far from the bridge now. That's good. So that's it, everybody. Another campsite and helmet brought to you by the Hiking Trio. <laughs> and as you say on the trail, happy, happy trails and good night. And good morning, everybody. Welcome to day five. Saturday, September 6th, we not, might, 2019. We might see some people today, maybe. Anyways, today is a narrow day. And you're saying, a narrow day? Where? There's no places at all. <laughs> But we're taking a narrow day here because we miscalculated our food supply because of those four day hikers and six day hikers. Shame, shame. KT, fastest known time. Put your disclaimer in. So, uh, Thumper is volunteering because he's a master hitchhiker to go into town on the road up there on LM. So, nobody can help us that's going to see this video now, but we're hoping there'll be some nice people. So, that's the goal today. He's gonna hump the town on his half cup of coffee and uh, drink one of my Gatorades. Leave my leave my chips alone. <laughs> and bring back some uh, Kentucky Fried Chicken maybe. In this box that can be packable because we had to pack out the box. Anyways, if he gets back by two, we might hike uh, seven kilometers, six kilometers to section K, K which has a designated our first campsite. Yes, with a teepee. With a teepee, our designated campsite. We're so excited. Anyways, as you say on the trail, happy, happy trails. trails. That's so corny. <laughs> and I am taking this opportunity to show you what true hiker trash is. So, Ivy Tat, Bigfoot, you guys aren't hiker trash. No way. Darwin, no, you're not hiker trash. Irwin, nope. Nemo, nope. This is true hiker trash. Look at this character. First, the character himself. Sandals. Oh my God, who wore sandals hiking? <laughs> and look at that busted up coffee cup. It used to be a nice black military army cup. You can barely see the army on it. But let's look at the pack. Just look, <laughs> look at the patchworks on it. Look at the garbage on the bottom. The patches, like who keeps a pack like this forever? Look how wrinkled it is, just like us. <laughs> but anyways, uh, that's his, that's a, that's one of the best items of 2015-16, the z Packs food bag, but he doesn't use it as a food bag. <laughs> <laughs>
But anyways, Thumper Man, you here are nominated the Hiker Trash of the Decade. Anything to say? Uh, I wish you expect, uh, I accept this cup with uh, gratitude. Mm. Hi, I'm leaving on a resupply ex expedition. We're four days in and we got four days to go still, so we need food. So we're, uh, I'm gonna hitchhike to Bathurst to the car. And uh, this is my, last month of my, was my 45th anniversary of my hitchhiking career. And uh, you never know how this is gonna go. So uh, fortunately, Bathurst is the only place around and all the roads pretty well go there. Uh, it is a Saturday though. My, the best ride tends to be a single guy uh, going to work or coming home from work. Uh, but it's Saturday, people are off work. So it, it, you never know how it's gonna go. So the way I do it, I just shut the brain off, the daydream away and, and start walking. And if worse comes to worse, I'll walk there. But other than that, no promises on time estimates. It's out of my control. It's up to the good Lord when I get a lift. There you have it. Anyways, Thumper. Yes. You're our hero. Oh, Jeepers. And if we're lucky, if we're lucky, and there's a Kentucky Fried Chicken there, and it takes an hour to drive here, I can still eat Kentucky Fried Chicken cold. Or Mary Brown's. She's got the best legs in town. And pizza. <laughs> no, I'm not touching pizza. Sure. Okay. No, no pizza. Anyways, thank you, Thumper. And you have a great day, man. Okay, I shall. As thank you walk you. away. <laughs> into the, oh, very important. We need that. Yeah. When I come back in at midnight. Oh. Ah. <laughs> and here he goes, being Thumper, skipping and wasting his energy for the day in the early mornings. Wave goodbye, Thumper. <laughs> Well, five hours later, still raining on our zero day. It's about 5.30 right now, and still no sign of Thumper. I hope he got a lift before the storm started. I'm just waiting it out somewhere else until it stops. Oh well, Thumper, we're thinking about you. <laughs>